Hi, this is Andrew for Geek News Central. This afternoon we're going to take a look at one of my other interests, namely watches, and in particular the Enoxon Fly E03 in bronze, just as you've got on the screen here. So today I was lucky enough to visit Enoxon in their uh, studio in South Belfast, uh, in, here in Northern Ireland, which is where I live. Uh, I think it'd be fair to say they're a Northern Irish firm with Scandinavian flair, and it was great to see the range of watches that they have on offer. So also a big shout out to Hans and Oliver, who took some time out of their day to show us the range and their watches, uh, and I was able to pick up my, my bronze fly. For the purpose of disclosure, this uh, was, is, is, is my purchase. Um, this wasn't sent in for review or anything like that. Um, I paid full retail price at £350 um, for this, so I'm looking forward to uh, getting it unboxed. To be honest, I have seen it already, so I know what's inside the box, but um, I'll take it up to the desk um, so that you can get a better view of it and see what it's like. Okay, so back in a minute with the Enoxon Fly. Right, well, let's get this Enoxon Fly E03 in bronze out of the box. Right, so in the box there is a nice little card from Oliver, the Enoxon Community Manager. A big shout out to Hans and Oliver, and thanks very much for uh, entertaining us earlier um, and looking at the, the Enoxon portfolio. Really enjoyed it. Thanks again. Okay, so here's the watch. We've also got a extra strap and let's just get a few of these bits out of the box. I think that's just going to be that's just the. Uh, the warranty card, so that's great. And then a bit of bump, little postcard. Bring out some of the, so you can see some of the Enoxon range. You've got so obviously some of their diver watches. The top here, I think they've got a, a pro one. Um, that's their chronograph. Um, in all honesty, I can't say I'm a big fan of those. Uh, there's just something not quite right about the proportions, but it's still nice to see. Um, there, there this is as well. Um, they do have a number of other nice, uh, they have a lovely one, I think they call it the, the Deco, as in Art Deco. That's really nice, I like that a lot. And I think that's just the receipt, so let's put that back in the box and then have a look at the watch itself. So here it is, it's the, if I say, the Fly E03 in bronze. And I have to say, first impressions are it's, it's lovely, really like that colour. Really like the bronze. Well, there's even the kind of you can just see the kind of half K of the Enoxon logo on the uh, on the crown there. Let's just bring it a bit closer. Uh, and I like the the kind of subtlety of the Enoxon logo. Uh, you can just about make it there. It's, I appreciate it's a bit. I've got there's a sticky spot there, probably from me earlier. Yeah, just trying to. You can kind of you can kind of see it, but anyway, I like the the subtlety of uh, of that. It's great. Lovely strap. And so spec wise, it's thirty nine mils across, excluding the crown. I think it's forty two when you include the crown. Two hundred meters of water resistance, and it's a it's a screw down crown. You can see it popped out there. Um, yeah, there's a, a there's, shall we say, a firm action to the to the winder there. Um, there's 41 hours, I think it is, of um, of reserve on the on the on the if you like the mainspring. And uh, oh, I have sorry, I mean there's some things I just keep noticing of this. The I do like the the bronze of the of the second hand and really just the finish on the uh, the other hands is bronzed at the edges as well. So that's I, I do like that. Oh, that's really nice. I like it a lot. And it'll be interesting to see how the case patinates over over time. It's a, it's one of the, is it the CUSN8 materials from, um, for the bronze? So, uh, so yeah, it'll be nice to see how that, that changes over time. But no, I'm, I'm well pleased with that. And as I mentioned in the earlier, you know, I paid uh, full price for this. Um, it was all my money. There's, uh, there's no freebie sent for review here. Oh, that's lovely. 
Okay, let's have a quick look at the, the other straps. So this one's a, a rubber or a tropic strap. strap. Um, uh, as I mentioned, it's, uh, it's, you've got your 200 meters of water resistance. So whilst you might not actually be using it as a dive, a dive watch, uh, it's, it's going to be very usable for swimming or just going to the beach or whatever and going in the ocean. Oh, I'm not sure how the bronze in the ocean will work out, so <laughs> I'll leave you to do your own research on, on that matter. But uh, it's still, it's nice to have, let me just bring this down as well. It's still, it's nice to have a, a second strap. Another nice touch is the inclusion of, you know, we've got a full, oops, it's a bit wobbly there. We've got a full bracelet, or for, sorry, full, full buckle and is it a tang here. Um, so, you know, if you are swapping the the straps, you don't have to worry about swapping the bit on the end as well. Um, so that's a nice touch. Um, yeah, pleased with that. No, no quick release spring bars here. But uh, it's not really a big omission. You do get a, a spring bar tool in the in the packet with it as well. So that's lovely. So as I say, it's three hundred and fifty pounds for the bronze version. It is a bit cheaper. I think there's an offer on at the moment for maybe one hundred and seventy-five, two hundred and fifty for the fly in a couple of other colours. You can get it in brown and green. Um, which I have to say, I saw them in the showroom or the studio, and, and they look great. So if you're interested in those, do check out their website. Uh, and just to follow on from that, the website is enoxandwatches.com. I'll stick that into the into the video later on. Whilst I was there, we also got the. Let's just bring this back up again. I also picked up this uh, um, this disc in I think it is pouch. It's very nice. to keep the watch in there when it's not in use it's lovely and it's lovely and supple oh yes i like this mm. and you've got a nice little matching bronze uh, fastener there for the for the watch so I'll be able to keep all the bits nice and safe and and, and together so yes so i'm uh, i'm really pleased with that with everything here that's just to get everything to to get it for that money shot as they say there we go that'll do i'll leave it i think yeah so look as i say i'm delighted to see a uh, a northern irish uh micro brand or boutique brand or whatever your current f uh, name is for these kind of small volume suppliers um yes yeah, so i delighted to see a northern irish fir firm here um hopefully people will support them over time because i do think they offer a great range it's a crowded market out there i know but uh, I don't think anybody will be disappointed by any of the watches from um, from Inoxen based on what I've got here. Okay, so look, thanks very much. This is Andrew from Greek New Central with the Inoxen Fly E03 in bronze. Thanks very much indeed.